I knew something was wrong with this truck. You see, it wasn't running right and the check engine light just came on. We'll see what it is. It's like surging, like doop, 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 doop. Ever since it got warm, maybe O2 sensor. We'll see, we'll scan it. I'm glad I threw a code though. Thank you, truck. You're gonna guide me into the direction to fix you right now. Yeah, that's weird. All right, let's scan this thing. I knew something was wrong. Thank you, truck. We'll fix you. I don't mind that you threw a check engine light. I blinked out the code. I got code 45. Now we have to look that up. Yeah, code 45. That would be rich exhaust. Makes sense why it was running bad when it was in closed loop. I'm going to check the engine coolant temp sensor. We got to get a shitty laptop just to make sure it's reading right. The temperature, the ground could be shitty on it. We should really check that when it cools down. But I'm thinking O2 sensor because the amount of oil this thing burns. And um, I changed it when I had about 100,000 on it. It's probably bad. Plus, you know, it kills it because it burns oil. Try that. Or injectors, maybe. Let's really check the flow of that. Gotta check the timing of the wall. Timing could be off. Interesting. A couple things. We'll fix it. Ah, man. Timing's good. I think uh, we're gonna have to get that shitty laptop out and see if we can... Is this thing ticking? has a cam in it, a valve start rattling. Now we're gonna have a code, uh, a code whatever. Um, EST, EST code, whatever the heck that is, code 34 or something. This is OVD1, I love OVD1, I hate OVD2. Yeah, OVD2 is cool, but OVD1's awesome. <laughs> yeah, we gotta get a shitty laptop out. I do have a new O2 sensor. What I also wanna do is take that air intake off and, um, See if we're good with the injectors. It has old fuel in it as well. But we'll fix it. Really gotta get a good scan tool. Anyone out there, cheap OBD1. Because I have so many OBD1 cars. And the uh, OBD2 that does live data. I was thinking about getting a Taiwan, I mean, not Taiwan. Chinese um, Tech 2. You know, like 300 and uh, 50, I think. Moldy Mac has it. It gets shipped right from China. But it's a clone of the GM tool. But where's the GM tool made? Mm, China. So we gotta fix that. And tomorrow will probably be hot out. And we have to figure this thing out. I say O2 sensor though. Yeah, I might have to take that air and take off this to see the injectors because the ignition's good timing's good injectors I think if the injector was sticking that would run way worse I think it's kind of O2 sensor it's probably just throwing it off it's not going rich lean rich lean it's sticking so we probably get a code for the O2 that's my thought but I, ha I want to check the wavelengths why does this XP computer take so long to start up? We're at this for about 10 minutes already and still thinking. And if you try to open anything, it'll just freeze on you. Why? I think we're gonna take the virus scan off it. That pretty much makes it think more. Yeah, I would say the O2 is dead. Let's look at the volts. It's staying. It's running like shit. We're in a closed loop right now. Here it is running horrible. That is just running pig rich. I smell a little bit in the exhaust, but I don't think it's fuel injectors or nothing. I'm gonna have to give it some gas, see what happens. We can do it from here. Stop that computer, stop it! Stop that! Stop that! Now the O2 is kind of moving a little bit. Look at the long term and the short term. It should be around like 128. That's rich long term. GPS vault is cool. I, uh, it's running like shit. Take air temperature.
temperature, yeah, it doesn't show. Oh, that edge of cool and temp sensor, am I getting a reading on that? I take air. Oh, this thing's shaking like a bastard, man. What's up with your truck? pull that O2 sensor will it uh I'm better see now it's staying pretty much all rich in the O2 this has this point where it just sticks possibly O2 sensor I have a new one on my hoard this is a pain in the ass way to do it engine no I see the engine cooling cool 194 that's about right 194 oh yeah alternator starts squeaking yeah that's right okay I say O2 man smooths out then it gets shitty again smooths out because the O2 it's not going to trigger the light until it stays rich for like a certain amount of time or lean then you're going to it's going to throw the code I forget what that means fuel trim cell see the O2 it takes a while for it to get going it's an open loop by the way obviously so you gotta wait close loop here we go but even when it's in closed loop, it has that point. It moves around a little bit, but it has that point. It sticks rich. This thing is running like shit. Oh. Smells bad. I'll see other things I could do it on a um, throttle body injection, the injectors, but it runs okay. This idle's terrible. probably runs better because it's running rich instead of lean like it usually does. Oops, there we go. Alright, so we're gonna go find our O2 sensor, I think. And uh, maybe we'll throw that in tomorrow. See if it fixes the problem. Need a scan tool. What do you guys think? O2? It's staying high again. And then it'll eventually drops, but it's slow be a wavelength from like no volt to like almost one volt. See it's shaking. My battery's going dead enough playing. 